The following program contains dramatizations of real people and events. Some names and identifying details may have been changed. While working her retail job at a mall, 20-year-old Yanel is overcome by excruciating pain and lays down in the stockroom to rest. Unable to get reception to call 911, her boyfriend Dennis runs to get help while Yanel discovers a baby crowning between her legs and she didn't know she was pregnant. I'm just thinking, what's going on? What should I do? I don't know what to do. It was horrible. I was trying my hardest to push it back inside, but it hurt. That's when I stopped. I am freaking out. I'm thinking that it's a life and death situation. So I ran out to try and call 911 again. 911 operator was a nice time. I'm in the wall. I need an ambulance. My girlfriend, I think she went to label. She's having a miscarriage or something. Okay, how many months pregnant? We didn't she? know she was pregnant. She just collapsed right now. She said she's feeling something coming out. Okay. After the phone call was placed, I went back to her. You know, I told you. I felt like I was dying. Like I was being paralyzed. I was terrified. When the security guards had rushed in, I started attacking them, asking them where the EMS was, yelling at the top of my lungs, where's the ambulance at? Did you hear that? Did you hear that? Get a man down! I called the dispatcher about four times. The wife called like 20 times and no one is giving me any answers. Your unit has been assigned, they're making their way there, sir. You don't have like an ETA or anything? I don't know, uh, units. I don't know where they're coming from. <laughs> sir? Please hang up. Oh my God, when are they gonna get here and save me from dying? It was pretty hectic because there were people who were trying to get stuff out their stock room on top of you know, crying that she's in pain, on top of me yelling at everybody, where's the ambulance at? So it was pretty hectic. Finally, after 30 minutes, an ambulance arrives at the mall. Where's When the EMS arrived, he reached between her legs and he felt the head of the baby. It's okay, it's okay, stay calm, stay calm. I'm like, what is that, what is that? Just take it out, just take it out. He was trying to cut my pants off, but I told him not to, because it was so embarrassing. He's like, don't worry, don't worry, you're having a baby, so it's okay. When the EMT cut her underwear, I saw a full head. Then he said, ma'am, you have to push now. Your baby's head is already out. When the EMS told her that, I ran away because I couldn't process all that. Most people have eight or nine months to come to terms with that. I had about 19 seconds. 